coming to you live from White Plains, New York. I cannot get my phone to stay properly. Okay. So I have been a little MIA this week, and I apologize. Uh, a lot of stuff going on. Um, work has been crazy. Uh, Mark had some personal stuff he was dealing with, so I was talking about him. A member of our family passed away, so I happened to go to a wake last night, unfortunately. And um, you guys all know that I live in a co-op. And if you are not <laughs> from New England, a co-op is similar to like an apartment that you buy. It's a one-floor apartment. It's not like a townhouse where it's connected and you have different levels and stuff. So I live on the eighth floor of a co-op. And so we do not have in-unit washer and dryers. We have washer and dryers on our floors. So while I'm waiting for my towels to dry, and I finally have been catching up from this week, I got in what I, the product, the new product that I told you guys about called the Facial Resurfacer, which is similar to our, I'm reaching in my shower because I used this um, last night, which is similar to our polishing exfoliator, but look at that. See how it's like creamy, but it's got some, hi Angela, but it's got some, um, lack of a better word, beads in it. I'm going to open this for the first time. See? And this is more, I can't even get the top off. This is darker and it's grainy. And this is very good for people with um, very acne scarred skin, people who are very oily, that they're like, you know what, I don't feel like my face gets enough exfoliation from this one. This is a wonderful exfoliant. For someone like me who is very dry, this is something I would use maybe monthly or bi-weekly. This is, would be is similar, they're supposed to say it's similar to a microdermabrasion that you would go to like a dermatologist or an esthetician to get that done. And this is basically just to do exfoliation on a maintenance level. This is supposed to resurface your skin and make it smoother and everything. So tonight, for your viewing pleasure, I'm going to use this for the first time. You're saying, Joelle, what are you missing? And I'm going to say, I'm missing my pink leopard bow. Here he is. Woo! All right. So the first thing I'm going to use is my Foops makeup remover. You have to shake it up to combine it. And the reason that you have to shake it up is because um, there's oil in it. There's coconut oil in it um, because all of our makeup is waterproof that we need the oil to actually break down our makeup and our color to get it off. So I did put lip scents on very early this morning, but around four o'clock I put on lip balm because the weather's been so crazy and I put on lip balm. So as you know, when you put on lip balm, it actually breaks down our color. So I probably don't have any color left from 8.30 this morning. And our color does last four to 18 hours, depending on uh, what you eat, what your pH levels are, your hormone levels, all of that. How dehydrated you are. I'm very hydrated. So this is what Foops took off everything. Oh, if you noticed, I posted before. Oh, shoot. I'm getting a lot of comments on. I just dropped my Foops in the sink. A lot of comments on Smoke Topaz Shimmer. It's uh, not a new color, but I used to have, be right back. Shimmer. I don't have glasses or contacts on. I used to have just a smoke, smoked, I can't even say it, Smoke Topaz Matte. And I ended up buying our shimmer because I saw a video on another distributor's page and I said, what eyeshadow were you wearing? And she said, oh, it's the Smoke Topaz Shimmer. And I said, I'm not going to get me that. So I'm going to show you quickly on my hand. This is the Smoked Topaz. Wait. Where's my light-up mirror? 
this on the top now is the matte and the bottom is the smoked topaz shimmer. So I don't know if you can see what a beautiful, beautiful fall color that is. I've been wearing it this week just because of the different outfits and stuff that I've been wearing. I've been getting so many compliments. You know what? I'm going to keep it on my hand to show you that while I wash my face and do all this stuff, this, now that it's dry, will still stay on. Okay, ready? Ready? Okay. So first, with the polishing exfoliator, I'm going to wash my face. Um, I use a washcloth, and then this is our three-in-one cleanser. Comes in three different formulas. This is our dry. We have a normal to dry and a normal to oily. And I did see that we are getting an um, acne-specific line coming out within the next month. But definitely before the holidays, it will be available for me to order. So, just make sure all this is off. Okay, so I'm actually going to take my washcloth, the one I just used, put a little bit of the polishing exfoliator on it, and I'm just going to, oh jeez, no, I'm sorry, Poly facial resurfacer, I'm using the wrong word, and just rub it on my face. Oh yeah. Very grainy. It's such a different texture from our polishing exfoliator. And I have very bad blackheads always on my nose. Oh, this is going to be nice. And down here. Oof, look at that. You rinse off my washcloth. Can you guys see the grains? And this has volcanic ash. Nan Guy Oil. I don't know my contacts in. The perfect addition to your skincare of natural volcanic ash scrub particles and Cineplex Complex to speed up cell turnover and reveal healthy skin. There was. I know it's volcanic ash from the island of Vanuatu. It's got our Cine Complex. It's got Nangai oil, which is similar to our polishing exfoliator. What does polishing exfoliator say it has? Natural volcanic ash. Know. Can't remember the other thing that's in this. There's four things. <laughs> oh, Joel is tired. Okay, so just going to wash this off my skin. Oh man. Now you guys know that I have rosacea and I have very sensitive skin, so I'm going to be extra red when I take this off because just the nature of the beast. It's just how my skin is and my formulation and everything. But if, you, if you're if you not as dry as I am, say you are normal to oily, or say you've never exfoliated your face ever, you are going to feel such a difference. I'm just gonna go in the sink one time. Oh. I'm gonna go wipe my face. Okay, this is the first time I've opened this product and the first time I've used it. I cannot believe how smooth, can you see the shine on my nose just from doing that? How luminous my little nose is? See my cheeks? My cheeks are normally very, very dry. I normally do um, once a week our detoxifying and moisturizing mask, I can really feel a difference. Jessie, hi! Jessie's my friend, and she helped me organize my, my bedroom clothes closets. Oh my gosh, Jessie, if you don't try this, I'll kill you. So this is 
the new facial resurfacer, which I just did, which is similar to like a microdermabrasion. It's a very granular, rough exfoliant. It's not something you should use daily. If you do have um, very oily skin, very um, unfinished skin, acne scars, you should use this probably two to three times a week for about a month to get your skin where it should be. And then you should maintain your skin twice a week with our polishing exfoliator, which is more creamy and a light and a less abrasive exfoliant. And then use this um, depending on your skin type on a monthly or bi-monthly basis. So I'm really loving this, I gotta admit. Can you, I wish you could feel my face and smell it. <sighs> okay. So while I'm still waiting for my uh, towels to get out of the dryer, I'm just gonna do my nighttime skincare. This is our anti-wrinkle. Comes in a little jar like this. It's wonder -mas. This is our climate control. I don't know how I ever live without this product. I use way too much. And actually, it's wonderful for men who have sensitive skin and get very irritated after they shave. They can just spray it on. It's unscented, which a lot of men really like. And they don't really, and they can just spray it on and walk away. They don't even have to touch their face. I have very dry skin. This is the purest form of hydration for your skin. Now I'm going to use our Cineplex Complex, which repairs, which is a forget the I forget the stable stabilized vitamin C and it actually um, repairs skin damage. I only use this product at nighttime. I don't use it during the day. My Nan Guy oil, which was also in that in the facial exfoliator and the facial resurfacer. I'm going to put this on my skin because it's so dry and just put it all over wherever you're dry. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to seal all of this with our evening moisturizer. It comes in this huge tub. I've been using this for at least three to four months now. And look, it barely looks used. You don't use a lot of it at all. That was not a booger. It was lotion and eye cream. So the last thing I'll put on all around my eye, crow's feet, all of it. So, gotta say, I wasn't sure how I was gonna like this stuff because my skin is so dry. I was scared that I that it was going to make me feel even drier and this at the other, but I wish you could see in this other light. My face looks so shiny and luminous and like I literally just took a whole layer of dead skin off my face. I know it sounds gross, but we do. We have dead layers of skin that need to come off. So facial resurfacer, Jessica, hi Julie, just came out and it's amazing, amazing, amazing. If you have normal to oily skin, if you have a teenager who has acne skin, you definitely need this product. It's $50. You can either Facebook messenger me and I can order it for you. You can go on my website, www.senegents.com backslash Joelle Costello and order there. And as always, you can email me with any questions, concerns, comments at jcostello518 at gmail.com. Have a wonderful Wednesday. Bye-bye.